Hello and welcome to your second half of the weekend forecast. Reminder, you're socially friendly, right? You'd be friendly with me in person, so why not with the social media? CNY Jeff Matthews is where you follow me on Twitter. CNY Jeff Matthews is where you follow me now on Instagram. Let's have a look at the thermometer. Now, compared to the average of 58, Sunday, dramatic warm-up, 65. Monday, Columbus Day, 73. Tuesday, 80. No, you can't keep going. And then there's a shelf drop-off here as we continue to slowly meander down towards average of 58. And by the time we get there, it'll be lower. But by Friday, keep this in the back of your mind, it may be a struggle to reach 50 with nighttime lows under the freezing mark. Now that's not like shocking because it is the middle of October, but it's something to be aware of next Friday and next weekend. So meanwhile, a major warm-up is now underway for your Sunday. It'll continue through Monday. Then a major cool-down in a week's time. Next rain chance is Monday night while we sleep into Tuesday morning. Here's the reason for all the changeableness. If you look at the radar and this jet stream superimposed on top of it, Whenever we're to the south of the jet stream, it's warmer than average. To the north, it's colder than average. When you're near it, it's not far from average. Well, we've been in the bowl of cooler air for Saturday, but the winds are roaring across the plains of Canada from the Pacific, bringing in warmer air. And so this pattern will translate eastwards to where we're now in here for Sunday and Monday, which will turn out to be way above normal temperatures for the time of year. So there goes the cold front off the coast that brought the cool shot for Saturday, the drier air for Saturday into Saturday night. And that patch of clouds is the precursor to those roaring winds that are creating those clouds because you've got the cool air getting bumped into hard by the warmer air, and that creates condensation or cloud cover. So Sunday, we'll see a period of increasing clouds. So having the front moved off the coast on a bright Saturday and a clear Saturday night, look for a bright start to Sunday, but the clouds are going to increase throughout the day. Meanwhile, here's a check of your own and I'll have you complete forecast in just a moment. Welcome to Intermission. Yeah, Intermission. So here we go for your Sunday after a bright early start. It'll cloud up a bit. Mainly cloudy, breezy, and mild with a high of 65. That's going to feel nice after Saturday's 55. And then breezy conditions continue through Monday, and it'll turn even warmer with a mainly sunny sky and a high of 73. And then it'll cloud up Monday night with a shower or two overnight into early Tuesday, and then it'll partially clear out. But then Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, these shots of colder air moving across the lake will likely set off some clouds and maybe some brief light showers or sprinkles each day and then it'll calm down for the most part each night. But it'll get cooler and cooler from Tuesday to Friday where it's a struggle to even reach 50 by then. That's a check of your forecast. Have a great weekend.